Welcome to Everyday English. Brush up on. Brush up on. Meaning. To refresh one's knowledge of a subject. To refresh one's knowledge of a subject. I need to brush up on my math skills before the final exam. I need to brush up on my math skills before the final exam. Catch on. Catch on. Meaning. To understand a concept. To understand a concept. Some students quickly catch on to new technologies. While others may need more time, some students quickly catch on to new technologies. While others may need more time, drop out, drop out, meaning to leave school or a course before completion. To leave school or a course before completion. He decided to drop out of the program to pursue a different career path. He decided to drop out of the program to pursue a different career path. Fall behind. Fall behind. Meaning. To lag or be behind in academic progress. To lag or be behind in academic progress. If you miss too many classes, you might fall behind in the coursework. If you miss too many classes, you might fall behind in the coursework. Hand in. Hand in. Meaning. To submit or turn in an assignment. To submit or turn in an assignment. Make sure to hand in your essay by the deadline. Make sure to hand in your essay by the deadline. Keep up with. Keep up with. Meaning. To stay at the same level or pace as others. To stay at the same level or pace as others. Try to keep up with the class discussions to participate effectively. Try to keep up with the class discussions to participate effectively. Look over. Look over. Meaning. To review or examine something briefly. To review or examine something briefly. Before the exam. It's helpful to look over your notes. Before the exam, it's helpful to look over your notes. Opt out of. Opt out of. Meaning. To choose not to participate in something. To choose not to participate in something. Some students may choose to opt out of certain extracurricular activities. Some students may choose to opt out of certain extracurricular activities. Read up on. Read up on. Meaning. To gather information by reading extensively about a topic. To gather information by reading extensively about a topic. Before the debate, it's essential to read up on both sides of the argument. Before the debate, it's essential to read up on both sides of the argument. Setback. Setback. Meaning. To delay or hinder progress. To delay or hinder progress. The unexpected illness set him back in his coursework. The unexpected illness set him back in his coursework. Take on. Take on. Meaning. To accept or undertake a task or responsibility. 
to accept or undertake a task or responsibility. She decided to take on the challenge of a more advanced course. She decided to take on the challenge of a more advanced course. Drop by. Drop by. Meaning. To visit casually or briefly. To visit casually or briefly. She decided to drop by the library to pick up some additional resources. She decided to drop by the library to pick up some additional resources. Handout. Handout. Meaning. To distribute or give something to a group of people. To distribute or give something to a group of people. The teacher handed out the worksheets at the beginning of the class. The teacher handed out the worksheets at the beginning of the class. Look up. Look up. Meaning. To search for information in a reference source or online. To search for information in a reference source or online. If you don't know the meaning of a word, you can look it up in the dictionary. If you don't know the meaning of a word, you can look it up in the dictionary. Put off. Put off. Meaning. To postpone or delay an event, task, or activity. To postpone or delay an event, task, or activity. They had to put off the meeting until next week due to scheduling conflicts. They had to put off the meeting until next week due to scheduling conflicts. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Keep practicing your English and see you in the next video.